Hello everybody and welcome back to our magical madness world. Me and Jack here again with another quick tutorial for you. And today we are going to build the magical altar you need to make spells. Yeah, let's get to it. And that is the finished altar. So this is what you need to make every spell. I'll give you a quick fly around so you can see it from all views. Excuse the yeah, tree. I fell in the puddle. Help. Help. Okay, here we go. Right, how do you use it, I hear you cry? The switch is for something different. We'll explain that later, complicated spells. But you bring, cry. you bring your book that you see from our last video, our spell recipe, because we didn't rename it. So our projectile dig. A simple spell, our first ever one with our first three points. So you throw it down on your altar and -da! it turns the pages oh, with pretty. the magic that it withholds. So to start every spell, this is how we make it. You throw a blank rune into it. So as you can see here, blank rune, pop. And then it disappears and you see magical streaks start to happen. Then the and altar tells us what we need next. So then we've got oh, Vintium pretty. Dust. Throw it in. Get out the way, Jack. I'm not in the way, you're the in the way. The magic sparkle happens, then we need an arrow. Be careful with the order, guys. It's important. Arrow. Oh, look at the pretty sparkle. Snowball. It's so cool to see this Minecraft doing this. I love it. Orange rune, which you just the make. sparkles look incredible. Dude. Orange die and a rune, so nothing too tricky. Our shovel, because it's a dig spell. They all kind of make sense, which is a nice little addition. And a pickaxe, again, so we can mine out rock. And well, to finish off the beginning, a spell towards parchment. the end, they start making a bit less sense. Like, uh, I don't understand why you really why you require a fish for a fire spell, for example. But you do, so <laughs> this happens. Listen to the magicians. Then spell parchment. That's always the final part. So it starts with blank green, finish with spell parchment. Easy to make. Two sticks and a piece of paper. Like and a listen scroll. to the tringle. Okay, here we go. And that, my friends, is your first spell. Every spell will look like this too. So then you grab it, comes into your inventory, and voila, we have a spell. First time you right click, it won't work. Let's try it now. It opens up, <laughs> ignore the fist swing, I don't know why that happened. <laughs> it opens up this, so in here you can rename it. So let's call this spell uh, my tutorials very never go as you plan. first dig. Yay. I feel like a TV episode or something. And then you can choose a picture, so you can label them as you like. So, let's just say we like to use these ones because it like destroys rocks. So let's, my very first dig, then you press escape, and voila, you can see in the inventory bar, it is pictured. So let's Hit test me with it that dig spell, brother. Bang. Yeah, so you shoot a projectile ball out of your hand that digs and it only gets cooler from there so let's just spam it to show you guys this is how you level up your magic and it is so useful oh i've fallen i've fallen ah, there we go and as you upgrade obviously you can make it dig more as we showed in the previous video and then you can strengthen it so that the moon at the bottom goes half crescent and you should be able to mine out ores you can't do obsidian for quite a long time and things like that, but for now... There, there is a way to do obsidian, guys. You have to keep persevering, and eventually when you get high enough level, you can get full moon, which is the fully augmented version, which is when you can dig out all the things, and it requires the most mana to do, but it's the most awesome. That's a long way away. As you see, if you're level like 1, 2, or 3, and you do yours, your mana will go down very quickly doing this, but because I've played it an awful lot, it doesn't. But that is how, guys, you create your first very spell... Your first, what, the, the, your very first spell with the altar. The first one. 
And Woods. that's it, guys. So thank you for watching. Thank you to Jack for all his help and knowledge on the, on the altar, you wizard. Um, and we will be back next time to give you the next step in the tutorial of the magician. Goodbye. Yes. <laughs>